intent. Mm -hmm. And that's what I try to do. I mean, I don't think it's fair to take somebody's audio message and use that as a basis of a prediction that they made because, you know, when you speak, uh, you make mistakes and you adjust your message for the audience. Uh, I think we should only judge based on what people have actually put into print because there you got some time to think about it. And that's really what I've done with these predictions. I've used their uh, written uh, predictions. So, again, if people complain that it's not really what they predicted, let's say, well, it is in print, and here's, here's the documentation. And I'm hoping that with this dynamic uh, predictions table that we're developing, that, uh, you know, as young earth creationists want to add their predictions to the table, they can do that. And we'll incorporate that. We'll do that for all the different positions that are represented. And in the future, we may be able to expand the table, since it is electronic. Instead of having just four positions represented, maybe we could have ten positions represented. Mm -hmm. Okay, look forward to that. I have more questions, but I think we'll leave it at that, because we don't want to give away everything that's in the book. Uh, well, how about the next uh, chapter, Hugh? What's in Chapter 18? Well, the book is called More Than a Theory, and so what I do in the last chapter is show how this uh, creation-evolution testing um, methodology that we've developed uh, has a lot more going for it than simply determining which creation-evolution model uh, or models are successful and which ones are failing, and uh, trying to settle the creation-evolution debates. So we think there's a lot more at stake in this. For example, uh, people's impression about uh, science, people's impression about Christianity. Uh, you know, so a lot of the philosophical uh, possibilities, uh, and that's why we titled the book More Than a Theory. It's not just a scientific testing enterprise. It actually has profound sociological implications. So that's kind of what the last chapter is all Great, about. Great, good teaser for that. We'll look forward mm -hmm. to it next time. Thanks for listening.